After your file is finished downloading, go ahead and double click on the executable, click run, And then what we're going to do is just click next, next, and we can just go with the typical installation for this one. And we'll keep it at the commander interface and go ahead and install. And that's how you download and install WinSCP. Alright, so I'm going to show you how to save and store information on WinSCP. What you do is you go down to Storage Sessions and you click New and type in your host name, then your username and your password. What you do then is you go down and click Save and it will prompt you with this. Now you can either save your password or not. I don't recommend it for public computers because it would be a really good way to lose your information. So I'll just leave it unchecked for now. Okay and then you click OK and what you do is then you click login it will prompt you for your password again click OK and it will bring you up to your main directory now that you've logged in with WinSCP we're going to show you how to transfer files from your computer to the FTP server first we're going to make a new file And we're going to drag and drop this from our desktop to the WinSCP. Copy it. And we're going to refresh this page with Firefox. And here it is.